Hello guys. Hello Phoebe. <laughs> Phoebe sleepy. <laughs> hello guys welcome back to my channel i am so happy that you tuned into this video once again if you're new to this channel please do well to hit the subscribe button and if you are already a subscriber please share the video all right so yeah today as you can see i have a wonderful guest in the house guys drum drop <laughs> yeah guys so i decided that i'm going to bring you a guest the reason being that you know i don't know everything and that is a fact of life so i think that it's in your best interest and mine too that i find someone who has a little bit of expertise in an area you know like mr zelf here so he's going to introduce himself because honestly i just know him as someone who is really into fitness and grooming I'm, I and try, all i try i try i'm trying <laughs> oh you see now he's acting humble <laughs> but yeah you know what i'm talking about yeah so mr self welcome to my channel and please feel free you can introduce yourself yeah hey first of all thank you for inviting me to your channel i am a big fan maybe the, the number one fan <laughs> <laughs> about that i don't know for okay where, where. yeah I guess, so yeah uh yeah thank you very much for inviting me for adding on this episode on your channel mm -hmm. and uh i'm really happy to be here and uh humble that i got a chance from you to be part of i was always wondering like when will my time come you know? <laughs> <laughs> is that so for real, for real, for, because wow. i've seen a lot of my friends mm -hmm. iman he's my guy iman from oh Emmanuel, yeah yeah who else python yeah, Python. So, oh, yeah. Python. Yeah, so yeah, thank you very much for inviting me. Oh, yeah. And uh, yeah, as she said, my name is Zef. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm also a content creator as her. So when she told me like, hey, I want to shoot a video with you about one, two, three, mm -hmm. I was excited and uh, yeah, I'm happy to be here. Okay, thank you very yeah. much. Yeah. So before we get deep into the main content of today, yeah, yeah I just have some icebreaker, oh, yeah. some icebreaker questions. Yeah. yeah, feel free to say you're not comfortable as uh, it's, answering. It's, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. So yeah, the first question is: Would you rather date a pretty girl with bad behavior or bad character, rather, or mm. an ugly girl? but with good character i guess so pretty girl but behavior sucks right yeah but uh ugly and uh good character right mm -hmm. oh that's, that's <laughs> hard, man, right? because you know us guys like 70 percent yeah our attractiveness when it comes to females uh all about physical appearance you know yeah mostly. guys may say oh it's about other things personality no but for us men it's really more about physical appearance yeah so if a girl is pretty but behavior sucks mm -hmm. ugly but good behavior yeah there's no in between right no no <laughs> you have to choose one <laughs> okay oh man yeah i know <laughs> damn <sighs> hmm. okay ah Da -da. you guys you can also comment what you think okay but I, guys you can tell me which one you would choose because you're mm. that's a hard one <laughs> oh, okay mm. yeah i can see it's really hard <laughs> damn wow so looks they really matter you girls <sighs> can, can you see I'm that sorry. anyway okay i would have to go with mm -hmm. okay Mm. I'm very curious. Right? <laughs> <laughs> because if I choose a pretty one, she's just gonna make me like my day worse, you know? Yeah. Because at the, at the end of the day, when I come home, mm -hmm. I wanna have peace, you know, especially if I had a long day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I will even won't be able to have a good family with the pretty one because if the behavior sucks, then yeah. the family won't be stable. That's I think okay. I'll go with the ugly one. The ugly one. Yeah, oh. because I'm trying to be realistic. If I choose a pretty one and mm. the behavior sucks, right? Mm. She may even cheat on me. Yeah. 
So what's the point of having a relationship with someone? You can who... take nice pictures. Ah no. Okay. <laughs> and okay. <laughs> and that... now your boys won't be laughing at you. <laughs> that is so true. That is so true. Like if I was young back then, yeah. I'd be like, okay, I can go with a pretty one. Yeah. Know? But mm-hmm. I think the the older you get, mm-hmm. you start seeing, okay, pretty girl. Mm-hmm. I mean having pretty girls, I mean a pretty girl it's okay. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, especially if you are at a point of a life whereby you're trying to build something. Yeah. Having someone who you can really trust mm-hmm. and who has values and morals and ethics, mm-hmm. it's very important than the physical appearance. So for wow. me, I mean, it's, it's not the best choice, but I mean, it's not the choice which I would go for. The I would, ideal yeah, idea. Yeah. I, I usually go like a balance, pity mm-hmm. really at the same time, good behavior. Mm-hmm. But because I had only two choices, I think I would go with the ugly one. <laughs> but uh, yeah, good behavior. <laughs> It was okay. also like one thing, like I know a lot of friends, even families whereby yeah. the wife, I mean the women are so so pretty, so beautiful. Mm-hmm. But they're never happy. Right. Because of it, something just comes up. You There's know? a lot of drama. Yeah. And oh. and if you really want to create something with someone in the long run, I think having that a happy vibe you know chill mm-hmm. vibe but in the house at the place mm-hmm. i think it's more important so i would go with the ugly one but good personality mm, i want to know you though what would you choose i am please no 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 what, 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 like what do you choose ugly guy uh-huh. right? but good personality you're not supposed to ask ask me okay, this I'm just question curious, though. i'm just curious though. i'm just curious you're not supposed to ask me this question I mean, I, i'm also curious i want to know what what would you take okay an ugly guy but yeah. good behavior yeah. does he have money <laughs> both of them have money oh both of them have money yeah the only difference is the behavior damn yeah right <laughs> because i know if i told you ugly but he has money handsome no money that would be easy yeah but both of them have money both of them have money yeah hmm well 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 because mm. mm, honestly guys i know like it's the guys who are usually like you want to have someone that you can look at in the morning and yeah. you're so happy yeah. you know but me too i want to look at your face and i'm like mm, god damn this guy is <laughs> you know so it's uh, but honestly i would just go with um <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hi uh, guys, I'm also thinking like, let's say I want to bring him on my YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, <laughs> do you separate like your? Do you okay? Are you type of content create, creator who separates he? I mean, have family stuff and mm. uh, work, or you, you don't mind combining? I mean, combining them together. Oh, actually, I I don't like combining them because I mm. feel like some things are just my life and yeah, I should not put them you. out them out mm. there. Yeah, so yeah. I I prefer to keep some things private, not that there is anything to hide or anything, but just me having peace. Because you know, people can say things, but if they don't know anything, they yeah. can't say anything. Yeah, true. Yeah. So, um. I'll, according to your uh, question, I think I'll just choose, if I'm looking at long term, even short term though, I think I would go for someone with good behavior. Good behavior, right? Yeah, as long as they also have money because, <laughs> because you can't be ugly and mm. be broke. <laughs> okay, I'm going to change. If it's a short term, I'll yeah. choose the pretty one. But right. But if it's a long term, mm-hmm. I'll choose the ugly good behavior yeah but for me i think yeah i think if you are considering short term you're just going to be like ah yeah i mean doesn't really matter yeah Yeah. you can okay i don't know majority of people but for me if it's like short term i can you know what okay yeah i don't want to say this but just for fun Mm -hmm. no any emotional strings attached because it's it's a short term but if it's a long term yeah yeah ugly but good behavior <laughs> yeah but for me honestly i think i would just stick with the good behavior because mm. i don't want to be stressing like mm. me wondering like what's up uh what are you hiding mm. like especially if i know that your character is not good mm. like 
I'm not going to stay there. No, I nah. I I prefer my peace over anything else in this world. Like sure. literally. That so sense. if I see that you're <clears throat> sorry, you're bringing a lot of drama into my life. Mm. Nah, you're just not my person. Yeah. Oh, so it makes sense. yeah, if you don't mind sharing, what is your body Monica count so limit? <laughs> For a girl that you are interested in. Oh, or you girl, don't right? Mind. Yeah. Okay. I'm honestly, right? <laughs> hope you guys yes. don't judge me, okay? Okay, so it depends. Mm. If it's... <laughs> <laughs> if it's for fun, right? Yeah. I don't mind. I, I just have some few things which are usually look Like, okay, I don't want... At the end of the day, like, hook up with someone who... Maybe there's a high chance of her having crazy diseases, you know? Yeah. So I usually try to, to look at those aspects, like not too crazy to a point whereby you may have some other diseases, you know? <laughs> so, yeah. So you're scared for your health? Of course, of course, of course. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh. So, yeah, for the body count, it depends. If it's just like for fun or, you know, a very, very short period of time for fun, mm. I, don't, I don't mind. Mm -hmm. But if it's like, I want something serious with someone. Mm -hmm. hmm. I will go with. Oh, okay. Ding ding. <laughs> so it actually matters if it's like a long term yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It matters. I don't want to have someone who was even. Okay, people say that people change, mm -hmm. but uh, ah, it's just something on my side which. Okay, like you have your things like. For example, you want to date a guy, right? And mm -hmm. you want a long-term thing, right? You have your list, like, okay, mm -hmm. I want him to be this. Like, you have your fundamentals, like, yeah, okay, he may not have this, yeah. but he has to have this. Mm -hmm. Maybe taller than you, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe he should he be stable. shorter than me, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. So, like, you have your fundamentals, right? Mm -hmm. So, for me, the body count is so important. Mm. And uh, uh, I would say... Two, three max. Damn. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, two, you know max. the reason why I asked I would this even question. Go with two. I wouldn't go with two. You know the reason why I asked this question is yeah. I actually discovered that a guy can have like hundred mm. body count, but then yeah. when he wants to let's say marry someone, mm. he's actually very concerned, like this girl, what is the body count? And I'm mm. like but yourself, you are in the three digits. Okay. Why is it that, that you... That, okay, that is a very good question. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if you guys will agree with me, mm -hmm. but it's true. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's kind of it's kind of contradicting depending on who, like, on who you ask. Mm -hmm. But uh, from what I know, women and mm -hmm. men are different when it comes to sex and everything right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. for women most of the time not all the time most of the time when you guys have sex with someone there's that emotional mm -hmm. connection somewhere right yeah i know okay you can have sex with someone with no any emotional feelings or something like oh he's handsome sex mm -hmm. whatever yeah you just hook up with him right mm -hmm. but majority of the time when you have when you want to hook up with someone mm -hmm. there's that emotional attachment right mm -hmm. so it's like for girls the more uh you have like you get hookups with people, the more man you meet in your life, mm. it's like every time emotional attachment, detachment, emotional attachment, detachment, emotional attachment, detachment. So in mm. the long run, if you have a lot of number of people or body count, mm. it's going to be very, very hard for you to, I don't know. It's like there are a lot of pieces of you taken out to a point where by when you want to settle with someone, it's going to mm. be not that strong as when you started. For us men, it's a bit different. And I'm not saying that, as men, we don't like uh, have the emotional attachment or something. Yeah. For me, first, it's more about physical, you know? You know, like mm. you see a girl, oh, she's beautiful. Mm. I want to sleep with them. I mean, with her, right? Mm. So it's for us, it's less uh, emotional attachment. <laughs>
Yeah, I think it's okay. I can try to push the light a little bit that side. Okay, okay. Because I don't want him to see the questions that I want to ask. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my> God, please. <laughs>